That's a look at sports. Take it easy on Joseph. He's a diehard Bears fan. I was just going to ask if you had any <laughs> updates about the Bears coach. Maybe we have a new one coming <laughs> that way. No, but you know what? Your Bears beat my Raiders earlier in the season, so props to you. You get bonus points. Yikes, yikes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. well, it was one of our few wins. Right. <laughs> okay, so we're uh, checking a little bit of snowfall maybe heading into the weekend. We'll get into more of that. I just want to talk about maybe the outlook as we get into that point. It's still a ways out, you know. It's it's only Monday here. We have to get to the weekend. But these are a few thoughts that I have. Cold air is definitely on the way. Um, I do see temperatures falling well below our average. Our average right now is about the upper 40s. I think we're going to be hanging out in the 30s by the time we reach probably Saturday, definitely by Sunday. The chance for snow on Christmas, we'll see. We definitely have maybe some moisture around. We'll have to see how quick that cold air starts to move on in. If it arrives by the time we head into the afternoon or evening, it's a possibility, but it's usually a 1% shot at the airport and uh, maybe I think two to three, maybe 4% downtown last I had looked. So it doesn't happen very often, but late December snowfall definitely is something that we see uh, frequently. And uh, how long is it gonna last? Not sure just yet as far as the cold air, but it looks like it may stick around for maybe a good five days, which means if we do see some snow, it might stay on the ground for a bit and just be prepared for travel. Um, being snowy, if you're going to be hitting the passes, if you're going to be doing I-84, we may be dealing with that by the weekend. So if you're going to be doing any sort of traveling, just know that uh, it may be snowy, and that could mean locally as well. All right, temperatures are off. Well, not too cold right now, but we are tracking that cold air. This is what we're watching. It's going to plant itself right over the Pacific Northwest by the time we head to about Saturday or Sunday here. This is some cold Arctic air, and that's going to definitely drop our temperatures aloft all the way down to the surface. In fact, check out the forecast trend. 40s, mid 40s next couple of days, maybe the upper 40s by Wednesday. And then it just crashes and uh, we're probably down to about the lower 30s if it's true. If the weather models are true and that cold air reaches us, uh, we may be in that mark for our daytime highs, which means you'll want to get those winter, uh, heavy winter jackets, the gloves, the hats, all the good stuff. Uh, the stuff you wear up on the mountain, you might need that down here. Okay, so tomorrow's actually the first official day of winter. That's tomorrow. I know December kind of feels like it, but we hit it tomorrow. Sunset's at 430. That's the length of the day right there. I have temperatures right around the lower to mid 40s for tomorrow afternoon. There's the cutoff low. It's just spinning out there. It's going to bring in some moisture Tuesday into Wednesday, which will spark this winter storm. Uh, well, probably a winter storm advisory or warning at that point in time, but it's just a watch right now. Could see 8 to 12 inches up there. All right, future cast overnight. We kick that moisture out of here, showing some clouds in the morning, but I think we'll actually have some clear moments, maybe some patchy fog, but hopefully we get some sunshine uh, as we go through the day because we could use it to help us dry out. By Tuesday and Wednesday, we have the rain. There's that mountain snow. It sticks around on Thursday as well. We get to Friday, still snowy, still wet. So traveling again is going to be snowy on the passes. We get to Saturday, here's Christmas. By 2 p.m. it's showing maybe just rain and a wintry mix, but snow all around us. Late Saturday, maybe get in that transition, that kick to see some white snowfall uh, here on the valley floor. I'm thinking more so maybe on Sunday, but we'll keep an eye on that. All right, so for tomorrow, temperatures in the 40s, about mid 40s in the valley. I'll leave you with the seven day forecast. 43 degrees on Friday there for Christmas Eve, 40 on Saturday. And down to the mid-30s with a chance for maybe some snow Sunday and Monday. All right, we'll be back right after the break. Keep it right here.